One of the things we've seen is that certain times of year, almost all the sharks leave. And the question is, why would they do that? So when we look at water temperature at these sites, what we found is when the water temperature rapidly drops because of a storm or what we call upwelling, which draws cooler water into the shoreline, when it gets below 60 degrees, baby white sharks do not like that and they migrate south. And this is usually around November in Southern California. It's the start of our first storms and they'll swim all the way down to Baja, sometimes all the way into the Gulf of California. And then the next spring, many of those sharks return back to these aggregation sites. So based on our telemetry, we figured out at exactly what temperature they're willing to leave. Now, one of the questions is, how do they know to go south? So as they're swimming around, the water temperature around them is all about the same until they get to a certain point where it suddenly feels a little warmer. So when you think about it, there must be some internal compass in their heads that tell them when I experience these conditions, I'm most likely going to find warmer water if I go south. That's really cool.